Hello! It's Apple the Morning Fancy Family. How are you wonderful, beautiful people doing today? Guess what? Once a week we upload a beautifully edited cinematic masterpiece to this channel. This video is uncut. What are you saying? Masterpiece. Masterpiece. I'm just mouthing what you said. <laughs> and, and in today's Uncut video, we're talking with Robin of Redline Shipping. Of course, one of our awesome sponsors for the channel. And we're standing here at the Redline booth at Fantastic. the Tinley Park NARBC Reptile Show. You know, I always say that, NARBC Reptile Show, and that's redundant, right? Uh, I mean, a little bit, yeah. It was a little redundant. I mean, it's such a great show, you should say it say redundantly. It multiple. <laughs> yes, multiple times. <laughs> this is yeah. the best show of the year, to me. All right. I think it's, it's the biggest show, the most professional show. This is this is a special show for me. It's, it's always kind of been special. The first time I came, particularly October, the very first time I yeah. came to the show was an October show. I know that's traditionally the larger of the two that happened at Tinley. It was just special, though. Um, what, what year was that, though? That was 2000... Oh, my gosh. I want to say it was 2000... It, somewhere between 16 and 18. I don't remember exactly. 16 and 18. Somewhere between 2016 oh, and 18. Oh, you're sweet, you're young soul. I know, I know, I know. I'm, I'm My a, first one, I think, was 2001. Yeah, well, I'm a baby. Right. I'm, I'm a small child. Now, I'm an old man. But it's been a fun adventure. It has been a I fun mean, adventure. I mean, for all you viewers, if it's uh, high res here, he does have a few grays. Yeah, there's two. I push them to the front you, every morning. You, you got to catch, yeah, catch up. I got to catch up. Shove them out there and make sure they're visible. Like you show that I am a little bit wise. Yeah. <laughs> Tiny. A little bit. It's, it's very generous bit. use of the word. Um, yeah, th hopefully the, the sponsorship has been good. You know, I, a notification came across my phone this morning. I, I just okay. thought it was cool. I was going to straight right there in my nose. Hey, people I, using Redline because like, of you. <laughs> I liked that. That's I liked fantastic. That. I do too. Yeah, it was just this morning I saw that. I was like, oh, yeah, it's good timing. We're about to do this video. I, I spent the morning of Tinley Park here hooking up new accounts in my room. So... So business. Redline is now number one shipper in the it nation. Is. That's accurate. Number one reptile shipping. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. That's yeah. It's pretty, fantastic. Pretty we pretty just good. hit one year in uh, September. So here we're in October. Thirteen months and number one. Something. Something we said for that. I mean, this shows not hurting. It's the parking lot is full. The parking lot is full. I had to go search for parking yeah. after I went and got my morning coffee. So, I mean, it's always a great crowd. Yeah. Right? It's always it a great is. crowd. It is. Um, if you want to move from one side of the show to the other, it takes 45 minutes. Yeah, that's a little tough. Those, those, I, they might need to move to a bigger van. I don't want to because I know this is Brian's hometown and everything. Yeah. And it's, so it's a cool spot for that reason. Um, and it is a really cool venue. You know, I think the carpet actually does a lot for it. Feels better. Feels a lot better. And those hard concrete floors. Yeah, I'm telling you. So, I don't know what, what would happen because right now it's like, there's still some space to walk around in there, but this is the first time I've seen the parking lot get closed down because it was full. I don't think I've seen yeah. that happen before. Uh, no. And normally I uh, cheat VIP park right up here at the front, and this time the fire department shut that down, so Brian Potter and I do not have our upfront VIP parking, which was drastically inconvenient, but I parked over at the hotel and walked over. Let's, let's take a look over here real quick and see what's going on around let's the corner. Right, see. Like attached to the red line booth. Yeah, yeah, we got something new. We got Adam with Proper Royals hanging out. He's been like live streaming most of the most of the thing. Don't worry, worry you're just eye candy right now. Don't worry about it. Uh, that's all the time, man. <laughs> putting away all his cash. Yeah, putting away all his cash. He's been making that. Just kind of like right here next to Redline. This is the first time you guys have done something like this, right? Where you had somebody kind of vending attached to you at exactly the front the of the second show. Time. Is it the second time? When was the first time? Well, last year. Last year, this we had, time? Well, we had Mega Condo last year, actually. Okay. In October? Spring. Spring, that's why. Yeah. I missed the spring one. Oh, okay. That was yeah. still this year. Yeah, you're not here. Technically. But, yeah, so we, we are in the lobby. It's a little bit different. We have a little bit extra space. And so, fortunately, we can uh, kind of flex a little bit and do some friends and family hookup. Um, Adam wanted to be at the show. There's obviously no space inside, so... We got him a little table here. He could go uh, show his wares, do his uh, live streaming, be Mr. Friendly. That's right. Talk to the world. And actually hang out with people without here, getting here, hold on. Let's talk, talking to this. I'm going to give you, here, this, we're uncut. We're not editing this, so here, speak, speak there. 
it's nice we can actually hang out here. We could talk. You're not getting run over in the walkway, but there's still traffic. Like if you actually want to talk and check out snakes versus getting run over in the lot in the uh, in the main room, you know, it's pretty cool. How are you nice feeling? Place. I'm good. I'm yeah. Good. Yeah, I behaved last night, you know. So uh, big Saturday is a long day, and then tomorrow we actually get a late morning, which Daytona could use a little. Uh, take a little note on that. Have a nice later start on it is, Sunday. It's a nice mellow start. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be good. Yeah. So, it's, you, you happy with your first uh, tin lead, though? Yeah, it's cool. And the people, like everybody, that's, look who I'm talking to right now. Yeah, I got Cusco and I got Robin right here. And yeah, that's the whole, that's the whole room. Like everybody's here. The vibe is great. Yeah. It's a huge crowd. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's good. And yeah, the crowd is good. There's lots of people coming and going. So I'm having a great time. It's very cool. And thank you to Robin and Redline. And guys, Redline, Redline, Redline. Ship, get it, use it, try it. <laughs> it is good. Customer service is excellent and things things work very smoothly. The website is great. Like yeah. the, the ease of plugging in the information and the saving, like it's, it is really good actually. Super fast, super easy. I, and the way the labels are right there, ready to print, right, ready to go, all the things you need to put inside the box, outside the boxes. Thank you, man. It's a plug and play. Endorsement. It's good. I mean, I, I, I use it and I'm always, Legit. I'm always happy when I'm, how easy it is. Like I used to, honestly, I used to like stress out a little bit when I'm going, I'm like, okay, I need to check this and check that. And it's like all of the button to like, just check where the temps are at the hubs yep. versus the temps of where yeah. you're shipping, where you're shipping from, just one click of a button and you could look, see it right there instantly. Yeah. What the thing is. Look at everybody walking by, want to get your attention. <laughs> you're a popular guy, man. Ah, oh, no, I got, I got nothing to say about that. Maybe they thought you were somebody else. Yeah, that's probably the case. Oh, was it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Probably thought I was somebody else. Who's more handsome than you, though? It's not about being handsome. No, it's your energy. <laughs> it's your energy and your vibe. I did run three and a half miles this morning Woo. to wake up. I haven't run in a long time. That was... I was just saying, somebody like after you? Like, <laughs> no, nobody's after me. Somebody's chasing you? Yeah, somebody like, chasing yeah, me. Somebody's chasing me. It's called uh, a safe place. Yeah, my, my, my potentially overweight and slow self was chasing me yeah. out the room did this you, morning. Did you tell the it's... audience that we're doing a grappling match next year? You and me. <laughs> hold on a second now. Hold on. <laughs> so there was, if you guys watched, um, actually, if you guys look for this weekend's video, there will be clips of what Robin's talking about. They did have a charity grappling match. Um, the second one that's taken place that Antoine has put on, and you, you'll see clips of it in the next uh, video coming on this channel um, this weekend. But supposedly, Robin and I are gonna do it. Just a little submission next grappling. Next time. The problem is, I've got zero uh, official background in wrestling. I mean, I have wrestled with some people, and it was uh, eventful and went fairly well for me. Good, good. However, I, I mean, Robin's a purple belt. No, I mean, it's not that big a deal. I, I didn't start training till 97, 98. So it's not, it's not been that long. <laughs> I'll take care of you. Yeah, we'll see. I, I'm, I'm willing to be humbled for, the, for a good cause. Whatever, How about man. that? I'm not gonna tear your arm off or nothing. <laughs> I guess I better start training now for Just next little, year. Let me choke. That's all. Just a tiny choke, huh? Yep. All right, all right. I'm, I'm willing to be humbled, honestly. I'm, will, I'm totally willing for, to be humbled. Me too. I, th I still think it's a great idea if we did like a pro wrestling gig. Like we'll script it out beforehand. We'll give them the best possible show. Right. So when Robin wins, it was just know it was scripted. Scripted. Yeah. 100%. It didn't just like happen naturally. It was, we, we wrote it out. And that 100%. Like... <laughs> we'll, do, we'll do the classics. Do the airplane spin. Do the pile driver. Can you do all that stuff? Overhead still? slam. I know you said you were old. I mean, well, I got old man strength, so. Oh, yeah. That's the yeah. real thing. Yeah, I can, I'll airplane spin the hell out of you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I'm looking forward to that. Um, Me but too. <laughs> before we cut out of this uncut video, is there anything you want to talk about, touch on that we haven't already? I mean, there's lots to see here. So I'm looking forward to seeing the rest of your uh, interviews and footage. There's a ton of animals in there. I've already seen some really great stuff. What's your favorite thing you've seen so far? I mean, I, I'm still geeked about inverts. Okay. Like, you know, I've seen plenty of ball pythons. I've seen plenty of colubrids in my time. Yeah. There's a ton of geckos, but for me, man, the hottest thing right now is inverts. Tarantulas, spiders, jumping spiders, uh, isopods. They got some really cool, like, giant isopod stuff. I, I just did, think that's so cool. I did get a vinegaroon and, like, oh, the, and nice. a Taylor Swift scorpion recently, okay. which yeah. is... Not usual for me, so. You, like you're gonna keep them? Yeah, like, like for educational shows and whatnot. And, that's awesome. Yeah. I mean, they look 
frightening. They do, but they're totally but they're harmless. Super, yeah, super gentle, totally harmless. Yeah, yeah, cool. great choice. But yeah, I, so I think the the invert thing is is the hottest thing in the reptile world. Uh, you know, in our world, it's not really reptiles, but yeah, just it in falls in exotic pets or just a different pet, not dog or cat pets, not right? dog fat cat exotic. or fish pets. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, there's a lot of great animals in there, and, and uh, I mean, I'm, we just now started looking around. I mean, it's only early Saturday. So yeah, sure. We got another day and a half. Well, I say, I say, I said not dog or cat or pets or fish because they, they have been exotics. It's been known, known as exotic pets for a minute, but I think they're becoming more and more year by year is becoming less exotic and more commonplace to have a pet like a reptile or a spider or an invader. It's becoming less of a thing that's exotic and more commonplace, I think. I, okay, that's what the, I'd like to see. On the reptile side, yes. Yeah. When I talk to people, yes, the geckos and snakes and ball pythons are very common. When I mention that people keep spiders, eh, that still freaks people out. <laughs> you know one that thing seems, I've noticed between reptile, because well, some of the most common fears, I think the most common fear on the planet is like public speaking. That's like number one. Okay. And just below that is snakes or spiders. But for people that are really um, scared of snakes, they seem to be okay with spiders and vice versa. This is what I've noticed talking to the general public. Like okay. if somebody's like, oh, yeah, I'm terrified of snakes, but you know, spiders are okay. And it's the opposite for people that are like, oh, no, spiders freak me out, but I'm okay with snakes. It's interesting. Yeah. I don't know what that it is. It is. Eh, you know, it's a weird phobia. Lots of legs or no legs. <laughs> yeah, and the, the brain plays weird tricks. Yeah, so, that's true. That's yeah, true. phobia, phobia. But, yeah, yeah, every, yeah, I agree with you. Like, the reptiles in general are becoming more mainstream. Super common, bearded dragons, crested geckos. It's taking over the world. I'm, I'm cool with it. Yeah. I'll ship them around the world. So, works for me. Well, hey, Rob, I appreciate you taking a little minute, and I appreciate you uh, admitting that when you tear my arm off, <laughs> At the next just for show. thing, it's just for show, and it was all yeah. scripted. Yeah. All scripted. <laughs> and thank you guys for watching. Take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and we'll see you on the next video. Aloha. Beep.